Hola everybody, Harry the Heart here, and today we are going to, or I am going to talk about how much, or addicting games, like, the little phone could waste so many hours of your time. Now, I personally have an addicting game on the computer, not my phone, the computer, and I bet you guys have played it before, a guard.io. But whatever you do, if you're younger, don't play that game, because I bet you'll spell it wrong in, in the um, search bar. It, let me do that real quick. Search bar, and you will type in A-G-O-R dot I-O. Now, what that will do is a scary face with flashing lights will pop up, and a girl will be screaming in the background. So don't go on that website. Okay. Unless you're a really good speller and your A button doesn't work for some apparent reason, don't go on it. Just don't. Okay, it's really scary. Yeah, I almost pooped my pants. Uh, don't do it. Just trust me. It's really bad. Okay, now that I got that all the way, some addicting games on the phone are Candy Crush. Yes. Candy Crush is a game, it's kind of like most other games, they just you know, drag your finger along to connect the dots. I mean, it's such a simple game, like Agario. It's just, Agario's a bunch of dots that eat bigger dots. Or, you're a small dot, and you have to grab little tiny dots, become a bigger dot, so you can eat little dots, and become number one in the leaderboard. And there are also teams, and they're inventing a whole new game mode, which is really cool. Because there's a lot you could do with simple dots on a screen. So, it's, it's pretty amazing how simple as the new smart yeah uh okay so another addicting game that i said last episode a gar no <sighs> flappy bird yep you heard me right flappy bird the game they banned i don't know how many years two years was it i don't know but uh that game is freaking intense People sit there trying to tap the thing when all they know, they know that the real version of Flappy Bird is impossible. I bet you see people on the internet 999 and then you see Mario and then you have to dodge Mario's firepower. But is it really that important that you sit inside trying to do Flappy Bird? I don't know, maybe you have like a wedding to go to and you're just sitting there in your bed just playing Flappy Bird. Then, and getting obese, then going outside and playing, I don't know, Flappy Bird in real life or something. Make you an obstacle course, as Disney Channel said. Listen to that stuff. So, it's pretty amazing how addicting games become addicting games. Now, one of the reasons is, because, I don't want to say it, but the music. Sometimes games like Geometry Dash are addicting I know Cario didn't have any, any sound whatsoever unless you put in a G O R A G O R dot I O. That's when it has sounds, but uh, don't do that. So, that's gonna probably wrap it up for this episode. And if you like the episode, please like the episode down below. Give me a thumbs up. That'll really help me a lot. And leave a comment down below. Goodbye.